Think Realty Nation. It's your host, Avi Golhar. Welcome to the Think Realty Podcast. This podcast is going to be so freaking sweet. You know why? We're talking about property, analytics, information, insights for you single family rental investors out there. Now, if you are not a rental investor just yet, we're going to talk about why maybe in another show. But if you are or if you plan to be, if you all your fix and flippers, you're listening, you're watching, you're like, yeah, I probably should own an asset once in a while, uh, then this show is also for you, uh, especially when it comes to making decisions on data. And I got to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor. Uh, Realty Track is the leading source of foreclosure data for real estate investors and real estate agents. Uh, receive the most up-to-date and trusted database of foreclosures, bank-owned properties, MLS listings, auctions, and short sales. Analyze property insights with comprehensive data with unlimited safe searches and no need to pay per record fees. Visit realtytrack.com today and get all started up. Corey, welcome to the show, man. Great. How are you doing? Thank you, Abby. Very good. All right. So give us a little background. Who are you? What do you do? Yeah, so uh, my name is Corey. I grew up in Michigan. We just talked about that off air. Yeah. Um, but uh, we started a company back in 2005 providing marketing services to real estate agents, um, the traditional virtual tour photography company. And we've, you know, fast forward 16 years, we're now nationwide. We operate uh, extensively in the single family rental space. Um, as a marketing solutions provider, but have now kind of gotten into the other end of the spectrum, the whole property life cycle, if you will, from start to finish, where we're actually providing investors with data on properties, full service, visiting properties nationwide to help them make decisions on their investments and due diligence and to understand their portfolio a little bit better and future repairs and really have a, a complete DNA blueprint of their portfolio or investment properties. And that's that's pretty much what's been taking up our time lately, 3D photography, property data, you name it. Dude, that sounds like a phenomenal t way to spend your summer and like all of last sure. year for sure. When all of last year, yeah. <laughs> Figuring something out new, <laughs> new and innovative. We had a little bit of time. Yeah, just, you know, maybe just, just a couple of weeks here and there for sure. So when a lot of right. people, people, not only real estate investors, but people in general think technology, they think that it's constantly disrupting their world. And then they wonder how the heck sure. can I add that as a, as a tool in my tool belt uh, to use to help me make decisions, whether it's due diligence, for example, on one of my rentals that I currently have or right. a rental that I want to acquire. How does Planomatic help with that specifically? Yeah, so people, when people think technology, they do, they get concerned, right? I mean, change is difficult, um, but you really have to embrace the right technology. You have to be patient when you choose it and select it. So um, the way we've kind of incorporated data into this is um, we go to a property, we do a 3D scan of the entire place, and then we put together a property condition report as light or as advanced as needed, depending on the property, depending on the investor. Um, and then we provide that information to allow them to help make better decisions. Um, and we're scalable, right? So we're not overhead. Um, a lot of the concern oftentimes is tech costs money. Well, that's not the case with us. We're, um, we're a very variable company. So we're an extension of your team. and We are elastic. We can grow with you as, as you scale. And so that's kind of been um, the, the benefit. I mean, we've embraced technology ourselves in making sure that we can turn these things around very quickly. So we, from the moment we get an order, typically through our API until we deliver it, and it can be not through an API, um, but we deliver that in 48 hours. From the moment the order is placed, a million things happen in between, right? We dispatch a contractor, we call them Planotex. Um, they go out, you know, procure the information, we get a process and we get it sent digitally back to the client. And so when I think technology, I think about that operation and I think about how we are able to scale our business to allow our clients to win as well. And so when I think about our clients or investors and embracing technology, I think, you know, is it making the operation more efficient? Um, is it producing a better product for the end user? Um, and it, does it fit, if, you know, with the workflow that's already there or does a change need to happen in order to make sure that it fits? What are some of the features, if I'm using your, if I'm using Planomatic, what are sure. some of the features that I can take advantage of right away uh, that will have yeah. impact uh, on my tech stack, but then also in my decision making when I'm looking at my portfolio or new properties to acquire? Sure. sure. So you're, where are you? You're Atlanta, right? Yep. Okay, so you're in Atlanta, and let's say you're really excited about Montgomery, Montgomery, Alabama, right? A lot of a lot of investors are excited about Montgomery, Alabama, but you don't want to fly out there. You don't want to hire someone full time out there. You may not be ready to have staff on boots on the ground yet, but you want to make some investments and hire a third party property management company, and that's okay. That's where we step in. 
right, as that third party um, company that will give you an unbiased opinion on properties that you might want to invest in. So you send us, let's say, to 20 different properties um, that you're under contract for. I'm assuming you've got a big portfolio and you're moving quickly. And we'll go out to those properties often same day or very next day. We will do a 3D scan of that property. We will do a property condition report for the entire property inside and out. And we can also provide measurements for renovation scoping so you can estimate that. Once your team has that information and they put the due diligence together, then you've got a much clearer perspective of that home or those homes or that portfolio and you don't have to move from your seat. So we make it really affordable, really fast, really, really detailed so that the quality is very high because these are big decisions that everybody's making every single day. So obviously then the question is, I'm just like on your site right now. Um, so, sure. so the question is, how much does this cost an investor? Is this a per property thing? Is this a monthly fee thing? How does that work? Yep. So um, we're, we're kind of evolving our, our, uh, our offering a little bit in that respect. And we found that in order to provide the very best level of service, because our, our purpose is we help, we exist to help our clients win. So we found that in order to um, figure out what that best service is and where that true value is, we go through a full testing suite where we, uh, on us, we go and we test our services and make sure that they cater specifically to the customer that's using them. Because if they're not getting the maximum value out of it, it, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't make sense to do it at all. So once we go through that testing, um, then we figure out exactly what it is that the client needs. And then we put together a solution and we do have a subscription model. And that includes a lot more of our uh, services like, like you know, our, our, our business intelligence dashboard through Tableau that we offer, our APIs that we offer, our dedicated client success team. Um, so with that kind of subscription model, it's been working really well. We've been able to provide a lot of value, but you can also order a la carte and our services range, you know, marketing services and, and property insights anywhere from uh, you know, low, low 100s all the way up to the five or 600s, depending on how much detail um, you need. So from a real estate investor's perspective, and all investors are probably thinking, well, okay, if I'm, let's say it's 250 bucks, how much sure. of a return am I gonna make on the $250? Like, how do I quantify spending money? Yeah, so I think you have to look at it a little bit bigger, right? It's a complex um, situation. So how much overhead are you having to, you know, hire and keep staffed in every market that you go to, right? Or that you're in. If you want to open a new market, what has to happen? How many boots on the ground do you need internally in order to make that a success? So um, it, it's hard. It, it just totally depends on how big the client is or how small the client is, but it can be anything from saving airfare to saving, you know, 50 to 100 people staffed across the country in every market, right? And then you're talking about speed. I mean, we found that these 3D tours can save uh, and 23% less days on market when using 3D. So, how, you know, how do you quantify the days on market? How do you quantify the additional rent that you're getting out of your uh, properties because you're making the right decisions? How do you quantify uh, staffing people, hundreds or thousands of people across the country to do the due diligence, do the renovations, like let everybody do what they do best and you'll have a far more efficient you know, process and operation and allow us to kind of fit in where we need to so that we can help you make the decisions that you need to make. Yeah, especially for investors that, are, uh, that, that live in super expensive cities, right? For example, or even states. Sure. New York, California, yeah, I mean, Washington, wherever. And they're like, well, you know, I don't want to spend a million dollars to own 100 square feet somewhere. I want to invest a million dollars in equity or $100,000 or $50,000 in equity uh, in exactly. the Midwest, in Indiana. And I don't want to have to fly there sure. initially. I want to dip my toes in the water and just kind of see what it looks like. I, the cost of flying from LA to Indy on Delta and like, you know, you want to, you want Comfort Plus because that's how you roll, right? Sure. <laughs> like, or whatever, yeah. or Southwest. To, yeah. yeah, that in and of <laughs> itself is a couple hundred dollars. So. Even yep. from the time return perspective, you're telling me Absolutely. that I get a, a picture package, I get all my analysis, and the ability for me to make a decision yeah. right now. And, and I have to give a shout out to our partner, Matterport, who's been um, helping us tremendously. We, uh, we utilize various 3D services, but Matterport has definitely been the leader in providing us uh, really fast turnaround, great floor plans. Um, you can actually measure the property 
after the fact, way after the fact, if you need cabinetry or something, that's all set. So we've been utilizing uh, Matterport and working with them very extensively on this. I have, I have a great success story just about saving. I mean, we had a client that was literally having someone drive from city to city in the Southwest, looking at properties that were under contract for due diligence. And we allowed this client to free up time for that person or those people and allow them to do what they do best and not drive around the Southeast, right? So there's a good example of of uh, old old way of doing things versus kind of new way of doing things. Corey, awesome. This has been really, really eye-opening, especially from the tech perspective, because you don't see a lot of folks using tech properly. Um, if there's one gold nugget that you have about technology, uh, and maybe also Planomatic uh, for rental investors, fixed and flip investors, even those that are thinking, hey, I live on some of the really expensive eastern, western, uh, east, west coasts. Yep. How do I how do I integrate this into my into my current flow into my current workflow because that can also be a little bit of a challenge. It can be an operational change is the biggest challenge there is. But yeah. um, what we do here is every time we think about a change or think about new tech, first of all we test extensively manually before we decide to implement technology. But once we have implemented that technology, it typically works out you know in our favor. Um, I, I recommend. Yeah, what we do is when we started out, we started out, we'd get a few orders a day, right? Like early, early on, I'm talking 2005. Um, but every decision that we made, you know, going back all the way to 2005, we always said, does it work yeah. with 75 orders a day? Does it work with 300, 500, 1,000? And if it didn't, we'd go back to the drawing board and figure it out. So think big, think scale, because this industry is just in its infancy. Corey, I like it, man. You rock. I love what you guys are doing. I think Great. it's groundbreaking. Uh, I mean, heck, I know if I come across opportunities, I generally end up flying there, and it's, I go through the Atlanta airport, and it's the busiest airport still. It just does not stop, and it's the time. It's, it's, the it's sitting mess. traffic. But it's coming back. I'm, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm ready to get out there a little bit, but still, not, not to go see a property, maybe to go see friends or go to a cool conference or something, and, not, uh, and that's not to where, see a couple properties. Yes, and right. that's where the energy should be. Right, that's the point okay. of, of having technology, um, of leveraging technology for your benefit, because you get your time back so you can go do the more important things like bumping elbows, fist bumps at, uh, at conferences. So, exactly. dude, Corey, uh, all the yep. best to you guys. We'll have you back here in the next couple Happy. of months. And uh, planomatic.com is where you live. Thanks a lot, bud. I appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah. All right, take it easy. You too. I'll see ya. <laughs> segment is brought to you by Residential Capital Partners. Uh, ResiCap um, is a leading private lender in the single family rehab and rental industry. Uh, ResiCap operates on a national scope while maintaining a local presence in key markets throughout the United States. Learn more at ResCapPartners.com, the 100% funding difference balance sheet lender. So what's the idea? Is the idea to focus on equity or to focus on cash flow? Hmm. In an article written by Andrew Sirios for thinkrealty.com, uh, he talks about one of the first things you need to look at are your goals. What type of investor are you? Uh, when I'm speaking uh, across the country, I always refer to, are you a uh, Wheel of Fortune kind of person or are you a Star Trek kind of person? Do you want predictable cash flow or do you want to take some risks and see where the flip lands you? Um, but he also talks about the cash flow bare minimum. Uh, quote, uh, the dirty little secret that many gurus don't want to tell you is that cash flow by itself won't get rich. If you use debt financing, it'll take a lot of properties before the cash flow above your debt service will be enough to live off of. That being said, cash flow still needs to be there. Buying an investment won't bring in a, that doesn't bring in a positive cash flow is a little more than speculation. So something that's a very interesting concept. You could buy 100 properties. Essentially what he's saying is, you could buy 100 properties, but if you finance 80, 90% of it, what's your ultimate cash flow? It's not going to be a whole lot. It's probably going to be 75 to $100 a month per property, maybe, depending on your debt load and depending on your uh, debt service. Something to really pay attention to. So set that, set that minimum barrier for what you want your cash flow to be. It's a $200, $250, $300 a unit, and back into the numbers that you want from the purchase and renovation based on that rule. Uh, he also talks about built-in equity builds wealth and reduces risk. So ultimately, if I'm putting a little bit of cash down and I'm buying smart, which is a little hard to do in the world today, but if I'm buying smart at a little bit of a discount if I can, that's 
building in equity so that your home price appreciation in a year or two or three gives you that extra step forward. So again, a couple of concepts to digest going into the next couple of days. If you're watching this on a weekend, maybe write those two concepts down and let that marinate for you. Two really, really important concepts. If you absolutely pay attention, and if you, if you take away nothing else, at least from this segment, it's the following. Cash flow is king. It needs to be there. And it can't be break even. It can't be $25 or $50 a month. That's not enough of a buffer. So what is your buffer? Identify that and work backward to your purchase prices and acquisition numbers. Think Realty Nation, that's a wrap. Uh, keep in mind, we've got a conference coming up at the end of Q3? Q3. August, September, October. Ish. Okay. <laughs> September 18th and 19th. I'm trying to like figure this out. No, no, no. I have a brain fart moment, but that's okay. Uh, that happens to old people. Old people. Uh, September 18th and 19th in Baltimore, uh, the Think Realty Hybrid Conference and Expo is showing up in style. Uh, but if you can't make it in person, not a big deal. It's also virtual. You can attend all the events virtually. And what you need to do to register is go to thinkrealty.com slash Baltimore. Register for two tickets. Type in the code podcast. And you get uh, one of those tickets for free. So it's a BOGO. It's a buy one, get one deal. Ha ha. Made just for you. Uh, outside of that, I hope you enjoyed the show. There's a, there are a lot of takeaways here. Make sure that you hit that rewind button and really digest some of the technology uh, that Corey talked about that you can use. And I got to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor. Uh, Realty Track is the leading source of foreclosure data for real estate investors and real estate agents. Uh, receive the most up-to-date and trusted database of foreclosures, bank-owned properties, MLS listings, auctions, and short sales. Analyze property insights with comprehensive data with unlimited safe searches and no need to pay per record fees. Visit realtytrack.com today and get all started up. That being said, you know where to find me anywhere online at Avi Golhar. And until next time, happy investing.